Hey Scorpio, welcome back to the channel. My name is Nali, aka Owl Tarot, and I'm here to give you guys your weekly reading. We're going to tap into this energy, see what is going on with you guys for this week. What are the overall messages and possible outcomes? Guys, before we get started, please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, click that notification bell so I can connect with you energetically. This definitely helps me out with the growth of the channel. Guys, as you all know, my readings are timeless general love readings, so they may or may not resonate with you. Please take what does, leave the rest behind. Time is fluid, so whenever you find this reading, you're meant to hear it. There is no gender in tarot. Please reverse the rules as need be. Cross watchers, you are always welcome. <coughs> Excuse me. Guys, if this reading resonates with you and you would like um, additional messages and clarity regarding your situation, you can always book a personal reading with me. The information is in the description box below. And as always, I want to thank each and every one of you guys for all your love and support. It is truly appreciated. So let's go ahead and get started here, Scorpio. I'm trying to keep the introduction under a minute. Let's see what is the overall energy for Scorpio this upcoming week, universe. Overall energy. Ooh, wee. Victory, Scorpio. I love it. Your week is starting off awesome. There's some victory. There's some triumphs here. What else? Recognition the ending of painful cycles so there's a situation that's definitely coming to an end here um whatever was holding you back whatever was causing you pains that's come to an end there's finally some victory some overcoming um barriers overcoming situations here dropping burdens so there is a lot of success for you this week coming up scorpio things are getting ready to change and they're going to change really fast i've just seen the eight of wands look at <clears throat> knight of wands here so there is some passionate forward movement you are taking the initiative you are tapping into your higher self and you're moving forward you're moving towards a situation that doesn't cause you any burdens that doesn't cause you any stagnation with the ten of swords you're releasing painful situations and you're moving on and you're moving past whatever turmoil was holding you back in the recent past what else universe what the fuck wheel of fortune a lot of abundance a lot of luck a lot of happiness if you felt at one point that you missed an opportunity here whether it's at work or in a relationship this was never a missed opportunity scorpio this was a blessing in disguise because what's getting ready to come towards you knight of swords is truth and clarity it's divinely guided it is meant for you you're going to be in this two of pentacles energy unsure whether you take you should take this opportunity unsure if you should move on and move forward in the situation kindly kind of juggling back and forth um uh, should i move on should i stay should i take this offer shouldn't i so take your time you're being told here with the high priestess and the two of pentacles really take your time dive deep within if this is something that makes you happy something that you have been working for trying to get to and it's finally here take your time make your decision wisely eight of pentacles you've been busting your ass to get to where you're at today and you're finally there so you don't have to rush making this decision just understand by you moving forward and moving towards this situation ace of swords in the reverse is finally bringing you a beautiful new beginning again decisions decisions this week some of you guys may be looking at relocating here possibly going to a new company wow king of pentacles stability and three of cups a lot to celebrate it may be time for you to turn your back to a situation that is not serving a purpose for you and it's time for you to move on and move forward there's a lot of stability coming towards you yes you're gonna feel in this energy that you've possibly worked for this company or you've been in this relationship for quite a bit how can you just give up how can you just walk away but how can't you how can't you if you've been busting your ass to get to where you're at now how can't you okay so it is time to move move certain things out of your way start looking at things differently prioritize other things and it's time for you to be a little bit selfish here and bring abundance clarity truth to you okay you've been working really really hard for this and it's time for you to take that leap of faith i'm hearing that it's time for you to take a leap of faith you got a lot of victory coming towards you a lot of success a lot to celebrate somebody is definitely thinking about getting a new car someone's definitely really considering about moving on and moving forward possibly to a new company walking away from a relationship that does not serve a purpose for you anymore and there is a lot of celebration celebration for your victory celebration for your triumph celebration for your financial abundance magician you manifested this you've been hoping and praying for this but I feel that in a, to a certain extent, you may feel a little bit guilty because you feel like you're walking away from someone or you may be leaving certain people behind. But at the end of the day, you got to look out for you, Knight of Cups. You got to give yourself love. You got to take care of you. No one else looks out for you but you. And it's time for you to take this leap of faith and make yourself happy. You've been doing everything to make everyone else happy. It's time for you to be happy. 
<clears throat> page of cups here in the reverse so i feel that there's going to be someone that's going to try to manipulate you to stay someone that's going to try to get you to stay they may end up using um manipulation taxes at tax tactics as you know, oh, you're going to leave me alone. I don't have money. You're going to leave me all alone. How could you abandon me? I've done this for you. I've done that. You're dealing with an individual who's very imbalanced, okay? You're dealing with somebody in Nine of Pentacles energy who depends on you a lot. This person isn't um dependable. This person doesn't do things for themselves. They really wait for you to do everything. And it's time for you to look onto your future. It's time for you to move away and walk away from the situation. It's time for you to relocate. So if you're sharing a home with an individual that completely 100% is codependent on you, you need to get out of this situation. You need a person that's going to bring something to the table just as long as you do, just as right as you do, just as much as you do at that matter, okay? It's time for you to move on and move forward. There's a situation that you are dealing with here, whether it has to do with work or in a emotional relationship, but someone is too codependent on you. They are holding you back from your abundance, Queen of Pentacles. It is time for you to walk away. You're in limbo right now. You're not sure, should I leave or should I stay? Should I leave or should I come back? What should I do? It's time to go. It's time to go. Somebody's going to beg you not to leave. Someone's going to try to offer you all these things. Someone's going to try to stay with you. They're going to manipulate you. But at the end of the day, you must take this leap of faith for yourself. You worked really hard to get to where you're at today. You worked really hard to finally get this opportunity. And it is yours with the world. It is yours. You have arrived. Okay. You have arrived. It is time for you to um, make final decisions. Okay. Okay. Be stern about your decision. Don't let anything or anyone hold you back. It isn't fair. You've done everything that you can to help a person. You've done everything you can to help a company. And at the end of the day, they never took your efforts um, in consideration. They may have taken a lot of advantage of you. They played too many games. They stole a lot from you. And it's time for you to move away from this situation. You may be feeling a little bit stuck in your head because of the decision that you need to make, but you need to make it. You need to make it. You need to bring in happiness, abundance, stability into your life. You've been dealing with so many other people's problems and never been able to really focus on you. It's time for you to take control of the situation. Again, three of pentacles, you've been working really hard. You must let go of these burdens. You must let go of these manipulating people. It may have to do with a relationship. It may have to do with a relationship that at times becomes very emotionally, mentally, and, and verbally abusive and it's time for you to let it go you're getting tired of the way this person acts you're getting tired of the way this person reacts to you you always feel stuck and it's time for you to leave someone in the past in the past okay with the six of cups in the reverse it may be time for you to let go of a relationship that no longer is serving a purpose in your life for others of you guys this may have to do with the relationship when it comes to your employer but it's time to move away from that situation there is no more wish fulfillment here as i told you earlier in your reading it is time for you to take that leap of faith some of you guys may Maybe taking a leap of faith towards a another water sign, a queen of cups. But it's time for you to balance things out for yourself. And it's time for you to move on and move forward. Okay? You're going into calmer waters. You're finally getting your just deserves. You worked really hard for what's coming towards you. And you got to make a decision to move on and go straight into your abundance and happiness. Okay, Scorpio? All right, guys. I hope and pray that this reading gave you the clarity that you needed. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Click that notification button if you want to book a personal. The info is in the description box below. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.